Hi everyone, how you doing? We're in London Bridge today and I thought I've just had a meal in a, in a restaurant that's on my other channel by the way DJ's Food Audits and uh, I thought on the way back I'll film the walk back because London Bridge, you've got the Shard, you've got Bower Market um, I'm going to cross London Bridge to a monument go right at the monument and head towards uh, the Tower of London and Tower Bridge I thought I'd take you with me it's been a while uh, I've con been concentrating on the other channel lately because um, it's actually become a part time job now so I need to I'll be working hard so this one is a walk from London Bridge to Tower Gateway So I've got Bower Market behind me no, and to my left, we're just leaving now and heading over London Bridge. just walking across the bridge now so to the right as we're heading towards monument you have tower bridge and hms belfast and of course the tower of london and to my left you see the bt tower and um beyond you well not beyond bt tower but beyond site is Westminster just around the corner actually but you can't see it and on the left of course is the South Bank building right ahead that used to be um, the house of Fraser but now it's the Wolseley City which is a beautiful restaurant I had a steak in there the other week on the other channel um, yeah because I <laughs> I criticize a little bit for having skinny fries with with a steak rather than chunky chips but hey that's another story just to the right here is the monument and there you go and they say if you lay that down the tip will land where the Great Fire of London started there you go oh, yes bad hair day don't care that's a nice shot so just up there on the right that is the walkie-talkie as you saw coming over the bridge that little point sticking out there is the scalpel building and you just see the tip of the gherkin and this is monument station 
and there's a, another angle of the monument. You can go up the top there, you pay, I'm not sure how much, you go online, have a look, but you pay, go up to the top, and they've got a, a lookout area or viewing platform. So we're heading this way towards Tower Gateway, which is the DLR at Tower Bridge. But it's just, the, it's the buildings, isn't it? It just fascinates me. Every day I'm in London and I'm in awe. It just, you know, I, I used to say in the, in the early days that I understand why London is like Marmite because it is so intimidating, especially when you're on the tubes and it's busy, it can be really overpowering, but just block that off. Some can, some can't, but anyway, I love London, as you can imagine. I was born here. So uh, now we're closer to the walkie talkie and you get to see the, the magnified glory of it. Take a look. Still waiting for someone to prove you wrong. Walking around. See? It's another little alley. So you've got a pub, church, and a dirty martini. You know, it's a back street. You'd walk past it a thousand times. That's how I find most of my places. I deliberately get lost so I can find these little gems, you know? See? I've just seen the place back there. I'm not going to tell you what it is, but it's actually going to be uh, on my videos very soon because like I just said you go down a back street and you find little gems I've just found one so that would be uh, that would be on my DJ's food audits channel well there's a name of a pub that absolutely goes along with the city of London you see the the tower of London there in the background but this church here a very interesting fact that not a lot of people know There's the magnificent Tower of London, and then just behind it there, you see Tower Bridge. And I'm gonna own up to something now. Um, by the way, I'm gonna just put a picture on of me um, when I didn't have any hair. Just so you know why I have long fringes now. Just gonna put that out there. But yeah, um, I'm going to be honest and say I've never actually been in the Tower of London. How about that? It's funny, isn't it, when you live in these cities and they've got all this history. I, don't get me wrong, I love the history, but there's still a lot of places I've not been.
So that round type building there, that was the old city hall for the Mayor of London. But now it's moved to the Docklands. And there's the iconic Tower Bridge. Not forgetting HMS Belfast and the London Shard. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little tour. Um, it's only a, I suppose, 15 minute walk, to be fair. So you get to see a lot in a short space of time. Uh, but just over there, just to finish off, got the Four Seasons Hotel. Believe it or not, that's a hotel. It's just majestic. Um, yeah, what can I say about London? Uh, it's the reason I live here, to be honest. Even though I work here part-time, um, I just love it. So if you enjoy the Damon John channel, guys, and get value from the content, I'll see you on the next one.